The following contest is a championship first round match. And at a combined weight of 468 pounds, A.W. North and Brian Chuck. And at a combined weight of 484 pounds, T.K. Oliver and T.O.C. Graham. Both legal men are in the ring and set to start things off here. We're ready to go. Boom, what impact. Oh, hanging off for dear lot. Power bomb. Tag team contest, a superstar and partner lock up against another duo. Unless there's a special stipulation added to the match, the traditional rules of a singles match apply in terms of winning the match via pinfall, submission, count out, or disqualification. In a standard tag team match, one competitor is in the ring against an opponent, and their teammate is in their corner standing on the ring apron. I should also point out that the competitor in the ring, as far as the referee is concerned, is the legal. Arm is grapevine. Try to step through. Uh -oh. Here it comes. Nicely done as he gets out of the submission. Color me surprised, Michael. I did not see that one coming. There have been times in sports entertainment when unlikely duos have formed and over time they develop and bond and become an outstanding tag team combination. The team that immediately comes to mind is the powerhouse duo of Cesaro and Sheamus. After their thrilling best of seven series, I wouldn't think they'd develop into a top tag team. Bang! Nailed it. I don't think anyone. A uh, Corey. It could be the beginning of the end. Ooh, what impact. Can he finish the job? His shoulders are down. And he breaks up the pinfall. Uh oh, man. What a slam. between the Hardy Boys and Cesaro and Sheamus over the Raw Tag Team Championship, the teams became very familiar with one another. 
In June of 2017, the teams met in a two out of three falls bout on the Monday Night Raw. The most important fall in a two out of three falls contest is the first fall. It's a great job escaping, trying to turn this thing around. Oh boy, he is rolling. He's making a statement here with this attack. The two out of three falls matches saw the Hardy Boys go out. He's fighting back here. I expected nothing less, Cole. Oh boy, he is rolling. He's looking at it. Nasty drop. That's what he was looking for, Michael. Dropped like a bad habit. What a stomp. Good grief. When this guy's on, Ugh. look out. Up into the electric chair. Setting him up. Got the head scissors on. Vicious strike. He's making a statement here with this attack. Superplex! Got every ounce of that one. This could be over. turns it around and he's heading back in he looks oh, man, incredible impact to think I almost wrote him off earlier here he goes oh, what impact this is his opportunity to win this thing can he score the pen oh, maybe two no shoulders up at two just powered out he might have it. Look out, look out. This could be it. Is he done? He breaks it. I can't believe it. I can't believe I'm going to say this, but I'm with the attack to the midsection. <laughs> I knew it was only a matter of time. Earth-shaking power slam. Incredible. This is what makes him one of the best in the business. this he's looking at it harsh impact and there it is boys looking to end it here this could be it and body blow you see the height on that Most of the truly great tag teams in sports entertainment created a double team finishing maneuver. The spike pile driver from Anderson and Blanchard, the heart attack from the Hart Foundation, the rocker dropper from the Rockers, or the doomsday device from the Road Warriors. A team needs to have a tag team finisher and be able to execute that finisher on all types of opponents. You gotta believe this one's over. Oh, what a slam! Landed him. Another great tag team match here tonight. I don't think the tag team scene has ever been hotter here in WWE. Corey, a few moments ago, you mentioned some of the great tag team finishing moves in sports entertainment history. Don't forget about the 3D from the Dudley Boys or the double drop kick from the 2017 WWE Hall of Famers, the Rock and Roll Express. In tag team action, like in singles competition, once a duo nails their opponent with their finisher, that should signal the beginning of the end. It can take a long time for a tag team to decide on a double team finisher, but I great job escaping, trying to turn this thing around. In order to be a premier tag team, a superstar and their teammate must have that continuity where they're a well-oiled machine inside the ring. He might have it. Oh, nasty impact. Beautiful technique. Oh, 
a lot of pride on the line here in this tag team encounter, but only two of these competitors will end up getting what they came for. The win. Oh, this one's over. One of superstars in a tag team going for the cover. The tag team scene here in WWE is undergoing a bit of a renaissance, and it's because of action like this. Nailed it. Well, oh, going to the top, high risk. He has him right where he wants him. He's close to being done here. Oh boy, he is rolling a long way down. Before you touched up. He's fighting back here. I expected nothing less, Cole. No, another reversal. Neither one of them are willing to give an inch here. Oh boy, he is rolling. Big headbutt. Wow, I thought he was a cutter. Oh boy, he is rolling. Tag team history was made when the first ever SmackDown Tag Team Champions were crowned at Backlash 2016. The unlikely duo of Ryan. Here he goes. This might be it. Oh, my. Double blade impact. Wow. What a gritty performance. He's struggling a bit here. Guys, this is where we find out what he's made of. Why he's still in the match at this point is beyond me, guys. Maybe he forgot it's a tag team match. I don't know. There's got to be some explanation. He's looked great up until now, and it's imperative that he doesn't lose focus and let his opponent back into this match. Boom! Harsh impact. Oh, look at this power. Boom! Spikes him down. Waist lift. Oh. Yeah, run. Oh, right to the back. Nobody controls the pace of a match. Right like this guy. What a stop. Good grief. Slam with authority. That should do it. Strong kick. My goodness. Oh, and it's a reversal. Lightning fast reflexes. Irish whip. Great job escaping, trying to turn this thing around. Oh boy, he is rolling. That running knee. Right between the shoulder blades. I don't know how much more of this he can take. He needs to find a way to create some space or else this thing's over. I think this one's up. He's not going to go quietly. No superstar worth his salt ever does. He's making a statement here with this attack. He wants it one more time. Beautiful technique. But he's running on fumes here. Does he have enough left in him to capitalize? He might have a vicious attack, but can he follow up here? He could pin his opponent right here. Two, three, they got it. Now's a good time to look at some of the highlights from that last matchup. Almost forgot about this one. Yeah, he's putting in the work. Look at him go. No doubt about it, he brought his A game, as you can see here. Here are your winners, A.W. North and Brian Cha. Big win here in tag team action tonight. Wow, I can't believe the amount of punishment that had to be inflicted in order for those shoulders to stay down for the three count. Thank you for tuning in tonight, folks. We hope you enjoyed that great match.